and that's as quickly as we will go from whatever I looked like before to what I now look like. Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I went through and I braided my hair up because I'm going to put a U part on. I have just decided that I cannot be bothered to comb my hair every single day anymore. You know, it's hot outside. My hair don't be laying down the way I want it to. I just have too much going on and I, and I don't want to have to deal with that on a regular basis, especially the days where I work. Now I have school. Mia, you know, I have school, Mia, and work. I don't have the time to be sitting down worried about, like, what I'm going to do to my hair. So, I've decided that I, I don't want to. I no longer want to. So, I bought this U-part wig. I bought on TikTok shops. You guys know I'm always experimenting with the U-parts. I expected this to be longer. If I straighten it, it's going to be longer, but also, whatever. So, I'm going to try it on and see. And that's as quickly as we will go from whatever I looked like before to what I now look like hello everyone so it is um, fix your hair season so i have my hair in these little braids everybody's very familiar with the u-part braid down okay i did the sides a specific way where this braid is loose just in case i wear a u-part that i want to leave my sides out otherwise it's up in the braids and this is what we're working with so now we are going to transition to putting the actual unit on and we'll be back. And, you know, we'll cover with the V part. You know, that's what we're working with. No product on my hair itself. Just vibes. Mia, how are you possibly getting up here so quick? messing up the hair did your dad employ you my hair is always in a ponytail no matter what I do to my hair it's gonna end up in a ponytail because I don't like feeling too much hair on me yourself hello you guys welcome back to my channel we're currently sitting outside waiting for Mia's dad to bring down an umbrella because I'm determined that I'm going on a walk today but it looks like it's gonna rain and I'm taking an umbrella with me because I'm going on this walk today I haven't been outside in weeks and I'm I feel fat but also we need some fresh air it's kind of humid but still we're we're going we're going I have my hair in this little braid in the back you know to take it off of me Mia's right hair it's literally climbing up come honey so we're waiting on the umbrella just in case it rains. I have a thing that goes over her stroller if it rains, so she'll be fine, but I need an umbrella for myself. I'm gonna pop by the Walgreens to and buy an umbrella at some point. And then, um, what else? I don't really know. I kind of know the route I'm gonna take already. We're not gonna go too far. We're gonna stay local. But, um, yeah. Should we go down there? Good job, baby. She climbed up the first step. She's in her climbing yeah. era, okay? And I love that for her. Somehow I'm in Marshalls and I found a pair of shoes. I really like them, they're Tommy Hilfiger, but they feel so flat. Mm. Like there's no cushion. This could be very cute in the summertime though. I don't know. Guys, I kid you not, I'm in this math class and myself, along with every other classmate, we are struggling. We have a little WhatsApp group for my specific union, 
um where all of us who are doing the same two classes so far and and we're just going back and forth talking about how annoying the man is and just how much he's not teaching us he's just giving us some answers on these sheets for us to regurgitate that information on the platform that he gives us homework and stuff on and literally unfortunately all we have to do is take that information and put it back on there because the man is not teaching somebody just asked him how um he got the answer and he was like if you see this on my platform will you be able to answer it and we're like no and he's like even though i've given you the answer clearly he just wants to give us the answers and and you know i'm saying in the group that for somebody like me who math is not my strong suit i need to be taught but he's literally not teaching and they said he has the best reviews i'm telling you right now i'm not leaving a good review because i didn't have a good experience i feel like people like this if you're not interested and you have no passion or no drive you should retire and i get wanting a check but at the detriment of us i'm not learning this is just information unless i teach it to myself two hours and 40 minutes later the class is done and i feel the same way how i felt when class started high schoolers go to school and be done with it one time you do not want to be out here messing around with living life and blah 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 10 years later and going back to school because this math class is taking me out and i'm motivated to learn i'm excited about learning but this man specifically oh I have nothing good to say unfortunately I'm not having a good experience I'm not I really am not I'm not anyway you know that's that's where I'm at today the mental capacity is just blown so we'll regroup tomorrow I said I was going to go on there and try to like do some more quizzes or whatever while the information is fresh in my mind, but I don't really know. I mean, maybe in a little bit I will try and do that, but right now it's 9 p.m. and it's Mia's bedtime and she looks like she's getting a little bit tired. I already fed her something, so I'm going to um, bring her in the shower really quickly. I'm thinking I'm going to just shower with her and we'll just have that moment to decompress and then I'll come out and I'll do some more of this when I'm done. I don't really know.